Hey, what's up everybody? I am at William and McGregor and if you don't know where that is, you can see on the map that I put along with this post. But I'm making it because you need to, if you live in Ypsilanti Township, if you're a resident, if you care about it, come to this Tuesday, July 20th, Board of Trustees meeting. Uh, they are going to talk about this so-called industrial and commercial revitalization district. It's a proposed, what I know is it's a scheme to get water and sewage in here from attorney, Township Attorney Doug Winters and Supervisor Brenda Stumbo. Check out on the map, it's just at the Rossonville Road exit. You go north on Rossonville Road, come down to the service drive, check out this area. It's not uh, an area that you would call, needs to be revitalized. It's never been developed. There was never anything here. It's just west of a landfill with radioactive waste. We need Ypsilanti Township residents at the Board of Trustees meeting. Get there at 645 this Tuesday, 7200 Huron River Drive. Let them know how you, how you feel about this, how you feel about the American Rescue Plan. You know, the seven-member Board of Trustees need four of them to vote where to put that money in the most uh, vulnerable areas and how to use that money in the most vulnerable areas of Ypsilanti Township. So, uh, besides the American Rescue Plan, uh, anything criminal justice related that you've seen in the national media, MSNBC, corporate press, any of that around criminal justice, none of that's happening in Ypsilanti Township. We're having the same thing again, $8 million proposed on the police millage uh, the, this coming August 3rd. People are voting right now. So the Board of Trustees, if you care about criminal justice, if you care about those incredible racial disparities that are in Ypsilanti Township, if you care about Ypsilanti Township, come out. This is uh, Tuesday, 7 p.m. Have a beautiful day. It's lovely out. Peace.